Hockey has made me a lot more confident in who I am. It's made me a lot more outgoing, very happy to be where I am at, and it's helped me grow as a person in so many different ways. The North Bay Ice Bolts have a lot of history in North Bay, and head coach Jeff Roynan notes it's not just about playing the game, but much more. Oh, well, there's, uh, there's a lot of history to the Ice Bolts uh, organization in North Bay. There have been um, many players that have developed and, and grown to be uh, leaders within the community, um, have gone on to uh, play high hockey at a much higher level than is available uh, in the Ice Bolts organization, and um, provide them an opportunity to play at, at their level. So whether it be at the highest level or a house league level, whatever they are comfortable at, but uh, first and foremost is, is developing a lifelong um, enjoyment of playing the game. And then all the other uh, side benefits that come with playing a team sport, being a great uh, teammate, uh, learning uh, to be, you know, to have sportsmanship, um, to support each other, communication skills, organization skills, and, uh, and just to become great leaders within the community. Showing how to be a community leader isn't an easy task but the Ice Bolts lead by example. I think what we're doing uh, with our teams is, is helping, um, but definitely uh, creating awareness, uh, creating more opportunities um, for the girls to see uh, role models, uh, be it former um, varsity level or uh, Olympic level athletes uh, getting involved uh, with coaching and supporting the players within the community and providing those role models for the players I think is, is great in creating that awareness and engagement. Laura McKenzie, a non-parent volunteer with the team, sees how much a role model can improve not only the game but also the team. Women's hockey in North Bay is so so big and the Ice Bolts of course is the forefront of women's hockey in North Bay. I mean I grew up playing hockey my entire life. I played university level here at Nipissing and I've always wanted to give back as a player and in a coach position. Um, growing up I typically had male coaches so I want to kind of shift that a little bit and become a mentor for um, young female hockey players. I think it's really important to have a young female uh, mentor or coach on the team. Um, a lot of them feel more comfortable with us than so than maybe a male or a, a parent. Um, so yeah, I think just kind of being open and staying positive and really creating those relationships with the girls are super important in them wanting to continue to play um, and compete at the highest level of the game. Chloe Chamery, an Ice Bolts U18 AA player, has been with the team a long time. Playing the game hasn't just been fun, but empowering. And working with volunteers like Laura has shown her that hockey doesn't end after a certain age. I think the Ice Bolts have been an amazing organization for me, and I've, I've started from the very beginning, and now I'm the oldest group. Um, getting to play with all these amazing girls, all these amazing coaches, it's been an amazing opportunity, and I enjoy playing and representing them very much. Hockey has made me a lot more confident in who I am. It's made me a lot more outgoing, very happy to be where I am at, and it's helped me grow as a person in so many different ways. Getting to work with people like Laura has been an amazing opportunity, and it's shown me how far you can go as a female in the sport, and how it's only growing and becoming bigger. The Ice Bolts prove that anything is possible. With an exceptional team, and exceptional volunteers, empowering young women can only lead to success. Ah, uh, well, the sky's the limit in terms of what they can accomplish. I think we've uh, we've proven that this year already with with some of the accomplishments and the growth that we've made. Um, but really, it's it's about uh, the commitment level that the players want to put into it. I think what we've shown them this year is if they uh, they want to work hard and they want to. Uh, pursue what we are trying to teach them as a, as a coaching staff, they can accomplish uh, whatever they, they want to. It's a balance between uh, pushing them to be the best that they can be, but ensuring that they're um, having fun at the rink and enjoying playing the game. I mean, we definitely have had our ups and downs. Um, I know COVID, of course, hasn't helped our hockey season. We've had, we've had a condensed season. We've lost a tournament, um, but the girls have stayed very positive. Um, we've been improving every game we play, every practice we play. 
Uh, so really, uh, the sky is the limit with these girls. They can do what they want to do. They put their minds to it. Um, so it's been really fun to be able to watch them grow and uh, progress as a team throughout the season. I think we just need to keep encouraging young girls to play in the sport um, and show them that it's okay, um, that there's a place for you and it's only become more prominent. And yeah, you just have to stay vocal about it.